Once upon a time, in a room so cosy, a magic toy construction set, feeling rosy. The blocks and toys, with colours so bright, decided to come alive one starry night. In the toy room, where dreams unfold, toy hammers, trucks and blocks of gold, a little magic happened, oh so sweet, as the toys giggled, ready to meet. First up was Timmy, a tiny toy truck with wheels that spun. Oh, what luck! He honked his horn, beep beep so loud, waking up the toys, a lively crowd. Next came Molly, a doll with grace. Her plastic smile lit up her face. With a twirl and a skip, she began to sing, a melody that made the toy room swing. Then there was Benny, a bouncing ball, always ready for a roll or a fall. He bounced and bounced, without a care, a magic ball floating in the air. The blocks stacked high, in a tower so tall, a Lego kingdom ready to enthrall. With a click and a clack, they built a gate, a Lego world, oh, what a fate. As the toys came alive, the room buzzed, a magic concert, no toy was unused. Toy instruments played a jazzy tune, a melody that made the stars swoon. The teddy bears joined in a cuddly parade with fluffy paws, oh so sweet. They danced and twirled, a teddy delight, under the moon's soft and silvery light. But wait, a trumpet sound, so grand, a toy robot with gears in hand. He clanked and clinked in a robotic dance, a metallic twist full of chance. The room was alive with laughter and cheer as the toys played on, oh so near. A toy xylophone tinkled in glee, a tune that echoed, wild and free. Now, in the corner, a toy castle appeared, with tiny knights, oh how revered. They marched and saluted, a tiny army so grand guarding the castle in a magical land. But as the moon shone, with a gentle light, the toys gathered, with sheer delight. Timmy revved his engine, Molly did a spin, Benny bounced high, the magic within. They decided to venture beyond the room's door into a world they'd never explored before. Through hallways and corridors, oh so wide, the toys embarked on a magical ride. Downstairs they went, with a clatter and a hum, passing by a clock that chimed a soft drum. Through the living room, under the chair, the toys were on an adventure, without a care. Out the front door, into the night, the toys continued, their journey in sight. A garden of flowers with petals so bright, the toys marvelled. What a magical sight. But as they strolled through the moonlit glade, a toy bunny hopped, not afraid. Hello, friends. Care for a hop and a race? The toys nodded, a cheerful embrace. Through the garden, they hopped and skipped, the bunny's floppy ears. Oh, how they flipped. Molly twirled, Timmy beeped, the toys and the bunny, a friendship beeped. But as the night went on, the toys grew tired, their magical adventure had transpired. They hopped back home with a yawn and a sigh to the cosy room under the starry sky. Back in their places, the toys settled down in the toy room where dreams abound. Timmy parked by the block tower so high Molly on her shelf, under the moonlit sky. Benny bounced softly. The robot stood still. The teddy bears cuddled. What a thrill. The castle knights rested. The xylophone hushed. The magical room into dreams softly brushed. As the clock ticked on, with a gentle beat, the toys whispered, Good night. Oh, so sweet. The moonlight kissed them. A lullaby sung. In the toy room where dreams had begun. Once upon a night, Benny softly said, in a room where toys came alive instead. We danced, we hopped under the moonlight. Now it's time for rest. Good night, good night. The toys closed their eyes, their plastic so still, dreaming of adventures. Oh, what a thrill. The magic embraced them, a lullaby sung as the room whispered, Good night, little one. And so, in the magic room, 
where dreams take flight, the toys drifted into the sweetest night. Under the moon's glow, oh so bright. Good night, good night, until the morning light. Once upon a time, in a town so small, lived a little boy named Jake, not too tall. He had a friend, furry and bright, a dog named Max, always a delight. Max had fur as soft as a cloud and a tail that wagged proud and loud. He loved to play, run and jump, especially when Jake gave him a big thump. One sunny day, with skies so blue, Jake and Max had adventures to pursue. They decided to explore the nearby park where fun and laughter would make its mark. With a leash in hand, Jake and Max set out, their excitement building, there's no doubt. Max barked and wagged, ready to roam, in the park, their favourite place to call home. As they strolled, a squirrel came into view, quick as a flash. Max, away he flew. Chasing the critter up a tall, tall tree, Jake laughed. Oh, Max, you silly, silly spree. But Max, undeterred, with a grin so wide, came back to Jake, ready for a joyous ride. They played fetch with a bright red ball, Max catching it mid-air, never to let it fall. Around the park, they skipped and hopped. Under the sun, their joy never stopped. Jake sang a tune, a happy little rhyme, with Max dancing along, having a good time. Max, my buddy, with fur so fine, you make my heart oh so shine. Let's chase our dreams, you and me, in this park, where laughter is the key. As the day drifted into the evening's embrace, Jake and Max slowed down their lively pace. They found a cosy spot under a tree, where Jake said, Max, it's time for you and me. They lay on the grass, gazing at the stars, counting them all, near and far. Max curled up, tail around his nose, as Jake whispered, Good night, my little pros. But wait, what's that rustle in the night? A bunny appeared. Oh, what a sight. Max perked up, ready to chase. But Jake said, not now, it's bedtime, ace. With a yawn and a stretch, Max obeyed, as the bunny hopped away, unafraid. Jake and Max snuggled, side by side, underneath the sky, so open and wide. The moon above, a friendly nightlight, bathing them in a soft, silvery light. Jake whispered tales in Max's floppy ear, of adventures shared both far and near. Once upon a time, Jake began, a dog and his friend, an amazing plan. They explored the world, hand in paw, chasing dreams without a flaw. As the story unfolded, Jake's voice so sweet, Max drifted into a dreamy, slumberous feat. The night was calm, the stars kept watch, as dreams of adventures began to botch. In the morning light, Max woke with a yawn, Jake beside him, the dawn had drawn. The park awaited, another day to play, with endless adventures, just a bark away. So the tale of Jake and Max goes on, in a town so small, where dreams are drawn. A boy and his dog, the best of friends, whose laughter and joy never ends. Once upon a time, in a town of rainbow delight, lived a jolly giraffe named Giggles. Oh, so bright. With spots like confetti and a neck tall and grand, Giggles loved laughter, the best in the land. One sunny day, under the sky so blue, Giggles decided to host a laughter zoo. Not with lions or tigers, oh no, not a bit, but with giggling animals, each a joyful hit. In the middle of Giggleville, Giggles set the stage with rainbow curtains, inviting every age. The first to arrive was a chuckling bunny, ears wiggling with laughter. Oh, how funny! Next came a panda, with a belly laugh so round, rolling on the floor, a giggle-filled hound. Followed by a monkey, swinging with glee, hooting and hollering, high up in the tree. Giggles announced, Welcome, dear friends. The laughter zoo is where the joy never ends. 
with chuckles and snickers, will dance and play. In the laughter zoo, it's a giggly day. The laughter echoed, a symphony so sweet, as animals giggled and shuffled their feet. A kangaroo bounced in with a hop and a skip. Pouch full of laughter, take a little sip. A penguin waddled in, slipping on ice, giggling so much. Oh, it was nice. A wise old owl hooted from above. Laughter is magic, the purest of love. Then entered a crocodile, a grin on its face, teeth gleaming wide in the laughter embrace. Even a turtle, slow and steady, couldn't resist a chuckle so heady. The laughter zoo buzzed with joyful cheer as the animals giggled, oh, so near. Giraffes, elephants and a zebra or two all joined in the laughter. A colourful crew. But wait, what's this? A surprise in the air, a ticklish breeze blowing everywhere. It made the giraffe snicker, the pandas grin, even the turtle couldn't help but join in. Suddenly, the laughter zoo became a tickle spree as the ticklish breeze swirled, setting laughter free. Giggles twirled and twizzled, joining the fun. Tickle, tickle, everyone! The laughter crescendoed, a magical sound, as the animals tumbled, rolled on the ground. The kangaroo bounced, the penguin slipped, even the wise old owl from the treetop quipped. With a final burst of giggles, the tickle breeze sighed, leaving the laughter zoo with joy as their guide. Giggles declared, thank you, one and all, for making the laughter zoo a laughter ball. As the animals scattered, joy in their wake, Giggles found a cosy spot by the lake. The sun dipped low, a sleepy hue. As Giggles whispered, time for dreams anew. But wait, the tale continues. Don. Once upon a time, in a land so green, lived a dinosaur named Gus, the friendliest you've ever seen. With scales so bright and a heart so kind, Gus was a dino with a friendly mind. One sunny day, as Gus roamed the dino glade, he heard laughter nearby, not too far from his shade. Curious Gus followed the sound so sweet and discovered a sight that made his heart beat. In a little house with windows so wide lived a little boy named Clyde with joy by his side. Clyde played with toys, his laughter did ring, a happy little boy, oh, what a wonderful thing. Gus, the dino, approached with care, his big dino eyes, a friendly stare. Clyde looked up, his eyes wide with glee. A dinosaur friend? Wow, you found me. Gus nodded. Hello, little friend. I'm Gus, a dino on you, I depend. I've been wandering the dino glade, looking for pals in the dino shade. Clyde grinned. You can be my friend, Gus. Come join my games, ride the school bus. We'll play with toys, laugh and sing. You're my new buddy, a dino king. So Gus and Clyde played, a magical pair, with toys and laughter beyond compare. Gus stomped gently. Clyde danced with delight in Clyde's little house. Oh, what a sight. But as the day turned into a cosy dusk, Clyde yawned, a big, sleepy husk. Gus, the dino, with a friendly wink, said, let's find you a bed and a dino blanket to link. In Clyde's room, with stars on the wall, Gus helped Clyde into his cosy bed sprawl. With a dino hug and a bedtime tale, Gus whispered, Sleep tight, little whale. As Clyde drifted into dreamy delight, Gus stood guard under the soft night. He roared softly, a lullaby tune, a dino guardian under the crescent moon. But wait, what's this? A little dino snore, Clyde's dreaming adventures, oh, what galore. Gus chuckled, his tail a gentle swish, dreaming with Clyde, a magical dish. As the knight wrapped the house in a starry embrace, Gus smiled, watching Clyde's peaceful face. He whispered, Good night, my little friend. Tomorrow's adventures, a dino blend. And so, in Clyde's room, under the moon's soft light, Gus, the dino, wished Clyde a sweet good night. 
in dreams and cuddles under the starry sight. Sleep tight, sleep tight, until the morning light. Once upon a time, in a world so wide, lived a magical star, full of pride. Its name was Twinkle, shining so bright in the velvety darkness of the night. In Starland, where dreams took flight, Twinkle sparkled with pure delight. With a wink and a shimmer, it danced above, a star so magical, spreading starry love. One night, Twinkle decided to roam, to visit Earth and find a new home. Down it twinkled, in a starry trance, a magical journey, a cosmic dance. As Twinkle descended, it saw below a little town all in a gentle glow. Houses twinkled with soft light, under the moon, a tranquil sight. But wait, what's this? A little child, looking up, ease so mild. Twinkle winked, hello, little friend, I'm Twinkle, here to lend. The child giggled. A talking star? How cool you are, you've come far. Twinkle grinned. I'm on an adventure, you see. Would you like to come along with me? So off they went, in the starry air, Twinkle and the child, a cosmic pair. Through the night, they soared so high, Twinkle twinkling, the child reaching the sky. Over hills and valleys and rivers so blue, Twinkle whispered tales of starry dew. The child listened, eyes so wide, as Twinkle painted dreams far and wide. But as the night embraced the dawn, Twinkle knew it was time to be gone. I'll leave you here, my dear little friend, back to Starland, where dreams don't end. The child smiled. Thank you, dear star, for taking me on a journey so far. I'll remember our magical flight under the moon's soft and silvery light. Twinkle twinkled, a farewell bright, and in a blink, it soared in the night. Back to Starland, in the starry sea, leaving behind a tale of glee. Now every night, as the stars did gleam, the child would close their eyes and dream. Of Twinkle, the star so far and bright, a magical journey under the night. And in Starland, where dreams took flight, Twinkle twinkled with pure delight. In the cosmic dance, in the starry sea, Twinkle shone forever free. As the child drifted into dreamy bliss under the moon's gentle kiss, they whispered, Good night, dear star, in dreams we'll meet near or far. And so, in the quiet of the night, under the moon's soft and silvery light, the child slept, dreams taking flight, a sweet good night, oh so tight.